goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. Alright. Yo, 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 games and graphics. We are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And today we're going to do an updated video on how to install Reshade. Alright. Once you get down to this download page, you can go ahead and read everything that's on this page right here. You want to scroll all the way down to the bottom where you see down download okay you're going to see the latest um version that was released and i'll let you know uh for this tutorials october 30th 2024 was the last uh, version released we are going to go ahead and select this first one which says download reshade 633 all right now as of this the only requirement we are going to need is gta 5 pretty much all right so once you have your reshade downloaded it should look something like this on my left hand side i have one download which is reshade and on my right hand side i have my gta 5 directory opened up and ready to go let's go ahead and double click on the reshade setup inside that reshade setup we are going to have this little box right here that's going to pop up and it's going to um, probably already locate your gta 5 setup but just go ahead and click on it and make sure that it has the correct path so as you see my path is down here and it matches up with my path that's up here inside of my uh, windows folder thing right here all right so once you have selected the correct gta 5 directory go ahead and select next then you want to select uh, direct X 10, 11 and 12. OK, select that, select next. And then this is where we are going to be selecting our presets that we want to install. OK, so this is what I like to do. I like to come over to the uncheck all button uncheck it and then select check all. All right. You have to select the uncheck all first and then select the check all that's going to select all of the presets down this entire list all right once all of the presets are selected go ahead and select next it's going to be installing all of our presets that we had selected just give it some time all right when that is done go ahead and select finish all right we are all done with installation let's go ahead and minimize any other windows we might have open and run the game as soon as you spawn in the game, you're going to see at the top of the screen, it's going to say reshade 633 or whatever version that you have um, installed. Um, as you can see, as you can see, also, it's going to say press the home key. So go ahead and press the home key on the keyboard. The home key is going to open up um, this reshade menu right here. All right. You're going to navigate it with your mouse. Go ahead and select the uh, continue or skip tutorial. We're going to go ahead and select continue for those uh, first timers. Um, and as you can see, this is the preset selection. All changes will be saved to the selected preset file. Click on the plus button to add a new one. Use the right mouse button and click on the preset button to open a context menu with additional options. Select continue. And this is where you can modify uh, different things in this preset, for example. So if you look up, you can see things taking effect as soon as you click it. All right, this is going to give like the, the close up effect and make everything far away seem blurry. Um, you got tons of these uh, different effects that you could put on, yo. I mean, there's there's a lot. Look, this entire list full of these. All right. So feel free to play around with these, you know, so you could create your own custom preset. All right. So if we um, go ahead and press continue at the bottom. Um, it's going to give us some more information and then select finish. All right. So from this point on, um, you can head out by pressing the home key again. All right. That also brings up that just exit out of that. Anytime that you want to bring it up, press the home key. And also you could change the key to bring this up um, by going, uh, going to settings and right here where it says overlay overlay key. This is where you could change it at. All right. So you could change it from home key to any key that you want to. All right. Feel free to change the key if you like. And if you also wanted to um, load up any uh, presets that you already had that you installed inside of um, your GTA 5 directory, because that's where all of your presets will go. You want to go in right here inside this drop down menu 
And uh, this is pretty much going to be your GTA 5 directory. It even has the address right here at the top. All right. Just place it right here inside your GTA 5 directory. This is where you can find all of your presets. All right. You just want to go ahead and select your preset and it will automatically apply that preset. All right. So that is going to cover this whole tutorial on how to install reshade. If this helps y'all out to install it or if you just enjoyed the video, feel free to smash that like button for me. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video with your friends that are in a modding GTA 5. Yo, this game's graphics may be balling ass, Frank. We are out of here till next time. Yo. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.